What's going on guys, welcome back to another video on the full transit recovery truck. Today what we're going to be doing is we're going to be changing the driver's wing over. We've actually got a new replacement wing there, so obviously we need to put that in primer. And obviously get that sprayed up. Um, it does need a bit of welding on there. There's a lot of movement there. So we might get that done in today's video as well. But that's what we're going to do today and then obviously in the next one on the transit will be the, the body work but that won't be done till till next weekend so yeah i thought i'd uh, document a few little bits we've got to do today so i hope you enjoy the video battered an absolute nightmare to get off now i'm still waiting on the correct paint uh, a few of you a few of the guys in the comments said that it was a uh, uh, the white from the mark 7 transit instead of the mark 6 it's a different color frozen white i need diamond white so i've ordered some but what i've done is i've all i've painted for now the new wing in frozen white and to be fair i actually prefer the mark 7 white if that makes sense so there's the new wing on it now. Just make it a bit bigger. It just looks so much cleaner in that white. Like the the other white is just like a yellowy white. Does that make sense? It does look so much better. I mean, it's it's a pattern park, so it's not perfect. There's quite a big gap down there. I've tried to bring it in as much as I can. Whereas if you look here, it's nice and good there. So yeah, I mean. <clears throat> What do you think it looks a lot better? Um, I mean, I've ordered, like I said, I've ordered the that white for the, um, to paint the wing and obviously do the, the sills and the arch there. Um, yeah, I mean, it, it doesn't line up the best if we come around to this side. You can see it's sort of, you know, it's not great, but I'll stand back a little bit there. I actually prefer that white to be fair, so it's a shame. What do you reckon? Should we paint the whole the whole cabin that white, or <laughs> probably make it worse? Um, but yeah, I'm gonna as soon as that turns up. I mean, what I'm gonna do is I'm not gonna take the whole wing off. I'll mask around it, paint it, uh, and then job done. But yeah, at least I've got a nasty rust patch there. Coming together just fine. Okay, so we've come along a bit since you last see the van. This is probably like a week or two since I last did that bit of filming you've just seen there. Um, we've started tidying up the back end. We had to put a new light in there because the uh, ports for the bulbs were all rusted. So we put a new light in there. We need to get a new number plate. Um, but what we're doing at the moment, we've got some epoxy primer. Obviously, we're, we're, we're painting all these bits. We've still got the welding to do. Still here, so we're not going to obviously paint the parts that need welding, but we're going to paint everything else just so it's less work to do. And just so we're sort of further along, there was a little bit of welding that needed doing down there on that because it was literally hanging off. So we've done that. And then obviously where the ramps go in there, we had to do a little bit of welding on that corner there. So that's now done. Just obviously need to paint that. Um, so the plan is, these, this, this, this part, let me make that bigger. So the plan is, we're gonna be painting this section black. Obviously all the boxing section is gonna be red. Obviously we're gonna epoxy primer, everything before it gets painted. 
Um, so this is sort of the outcome of what we're aiming for. We've still got that's changed, so we're going to get that changed. Um, I have ordered the box still, um, so that we're waiting for that to come, and then we can get the welding done. We're going to make a frame up for that. Obviously not in today's video. Let's get it off. Started sanding back the frame. I've got some new straps as well. I'll show you guys in a sec. Now I've got some reflective tape as well. I've done one side. Let me know what you guys think as well. I've done this side just to sort of split it up a little bit because it looked a bit bland. So what do you guys think of that? Me myself, I think it looks all right. I'm, I'm pretty happy with that. What we are going to do as well is we're going to sort out this rust up here. We've done everything else, so it'd be a shame to leave that. Um, so yeah, we're just going to crack on. Obviously, again, like I said, we're going to leave these sections out. I've got some new mud guards as well. I've gone all out. Um, yeah, I'm obviously going to leave that section out there. So I'll show you what we've got. Two seconds. So yeah, like I was saying, we've got a new one of these, which we're going to be fitting. Obviously, these are the old straps. As you can see, they've seen better days. So, so these are the new straps. I actually prefer these to the ones I've got on my truck. As you can see, they'll go well with that. So, once it's all done, when we advertise the truck, we will see put the straps on in position, get some nice pictures, and then we've got. Some new mud guards. We've seen better days. So just little things like that really do make a difference. So yeah, I'm excited to get this done uh, to see the, the end product. Uh, hope you guys are too. But yeah, what we're going to do today, we're going to carry on sanding down the bed. We're going to change the the roller. We're going to do the tape on the other side, and yeah, just just work our way through and and, and see how we get on. So. Let's crack on. Oh, uh, just another thing, not too sure if I mentioned it. I've uh, done quite a bit since last filming, but I've, I've managed to paint the uh, sills and arch the same colour. You know, remember it was a bit of an off colour. It's been sat under a tree as well, so needs a good clean. Um, that's the new wing. No more horrible rust. Down there as well. All the way down there. So it just looks a lot better already. Okay, so what we've done is we've now primed, epoxy primed all the frame. This is what we've used here. Just letting that dry. Bits to there actually. Um, obviously, I missed out the bits that I need to do the weld in. So, what we're going to do is obviously start spraying this a bit black. All this is going to be sprayed red. Um, we've removed that old one. Just need to pull it through and then we can put that in, but obviously we're going we're to do that first before we do anything. Right, so we've pretty much done the first coat of the red. So what we're going to do is we're going to paint these uh, runners. They're going black. And once it's all done, we'll come in. Uh, I'm gonna only going to paint up to there for now, because obviously I've got all the tools and stuff over there. So obviously once we get that painted, we'll, uh, we'll come back in and show you how we're looking after. Okay, so this is the current state of play. We've got the new roller on there, looking 10 times better. I've still got this section to paint and over there. What do you reckon? Miles better. Very, very happy. Um, <clears throat> so I'm going to clean all this stuff up now. I'm going to get this and that side done. Uh, and obviously we need to get the reflective strip put on the other side as well. So we'll get cleaned up and then we'll crack on with that. Guys, so the back's all but done barring the welding, um, which we've still got to tackle there. And obviously on the other side, 
we've painted where the ramps will go still got them to to come uh, I've just put two of the stra new straps on just to just make it a bit bigger just to show you guys what it's going to look like just put some little reflective tape on each corner and a little bit at the top there really sets it off nicely it's come out really well very impressed so obviously we've still got the mud guards to, to put on as well again they won't be put on until we've done all the welding we've got the tape around there as well does need a good clean because it's been sat under a tree we've still got a little bit of uh, rust to, to sort out we've put bulbs up the top there because one of them was out yeah so I'm actually very impressed very happy let me know in the comments what you think so far on the transit it's come a long way um, I'm gonna wrap today's video up there like I said we've probably got a couple more videos left before it goes up for sale if you're new don't forget to subscribe to the channel and if you do like the video don't forget to leave the thumbs up but that's all for today take it easy guys and I'll catch you very soon peace